Sam Saniba. I'm the owner of Art Painting Lab. When the pandemic struck, we, we thought, let's tap into this incredible art instinct that we are seeing the people essentially exhibiting, right? So we saw people faking, we saw people drawing, people dancing on TikTok, people uh, uh, learning new skills like photography, editing, illustration, all of that. Where is all this beauty going to go at the end? This, this moment of people being able to connect to their creative instinct, where is it going at the end of the day? And that is where United Art Emirates Initiative was born, where we said we'll take it and we'll combine it and we'll create something really inspiring that can show the world and the community how people can come together creatively even during uncertain times. So, and it was amazing because we did a call out and we invited um, the UAE population nationwide from Abu Dhabi to Ras Al Khaimah and Ras Al Khaimah all the way to um, you know, Ajman, Umm Al Quain, everybody's invited to contribute artworks to this United Initiative, this United Art Emirates Initiative. Hi, I'm Amna Bashir, resident artist at Art Painting Lab, and this is the piece I designed for United Art Emirates. It reflects kind of like how frustrating and weird and still this period was and how I couldn't wait to be outside again. That's why the sky is blue. I've seen a lot of liberty and love in the artworks from people expressing love for each other, unity for one another. We have people cheering on the nurses and the doctors. We are here for you with artworks like that. We have people contemplating into the distance, drawing uh, figurative artworks into the distance. Uh, my artwork or my contribution is mainly about smile because we all already like hidden behind these uh, medical masks, these face masks and we cannot see each other smile. Uh, so we miss to see our uh, smiles. All what we can see are just eyes everywhere. And what we've seen also all the uh, time, especially at the beginning of the uh, Corona uh, time, we could see only windows, we could see only uh, balconies when we were just all standing together there. And also this calligraphy and this just mixed letters is just explaining the uh, ideas, all of these mixed ideas in the head, you know, it's something like a cloud of letters around the uh, head. This country are very um, beige, it's a sand country, right? So the colors are beige, the, the, the city is new, right? So to, in order to integrate more soul into the experience of the people living here, art is always a great way to, to and that's why Sheikh Mohammed has started his, um, the, uh, the, uh, the announcement of the, he wanted to turn Dubai into an open air art museum so that when people come they can experience the, the color of the, of the people that are residing here, right? Architecture doesn't entirely do that, right? But sculptures do and murals do. And I believe strongly that after this pandemic that public art like murals and sculptures that are, not, that, that are non tactile art that you can just see at a distance and enjoy and be part of is going to be a very strong art form in